I'm making right now is um, essentially it's some sort of a, it's a potato, but it's a healthy way of eating them instead of you know getting like French fry where it's fried. You're gonna get real small potatoes. These are had a uh, purple, red, and white skin potatoes, and you cut them into fourths. And then what you do is you put them in the microwave <clears throat> for about four or five minutes, and you partially cook them. That's what's going on right now. And when they're partially cooked, they cook way faster on the grill. And so the next step you see is going to be me putting putting on uh, different seasonings. Um, they're partially cooked, just got out of the microwave. Next thing you're going to do is put them in a um, gallon Ziploc bag. And the plate's very hot, so I don't know how I'm going to do this with one hand. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually turn the phone off and be right back. So as you can see, the potatoes are in the bag. Um, they're still pretty warm. And the next thing you're going to want to do is add some extra virgin olive oil, some white truffle oil, some garlic powder, a Cajun of your liking. Um, this is a great salt-free. It has a bunch of vegetables. It's a seasoning. Um, onion powder and ground black pepper. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add all those into the bag right now and I'll be right back. All in the bag and now what you're gonna do is you literally just kinda, you know, mix it up. You know, like shake and bake. You shake it and then you bake it. Except we're not baking it, we're grilling it. So give this a good stir and then the next thing you see will be the next step of the process. But make sure you get it all evenly coated, and that way when you're cooking it, it's all well, obviously evenly coated. Step is you're going to need some Reynolds Wrap heavy duty foil. I like to double it up, and you're going to actually make a pouch out of it. So it's pretty simple to make a pouch. You, know, you just fold it up, whatever, make a pouch. Once you make the pouch, the next step is just to throw it on the grill. So I'm going to make the pouch and then show you the finished pouch. So here's the pouch, as you can see. Um, it pretty essentially it's air it's airtight so when it's actually cooking on the grill it's gonna pretty much steam itself in there and it's gonna get real 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 nicely cooked um, and even so and you can obviously when you're up on the grill we'll show you how to how to cook it um, so the next step is gonna be to put this on the grill but there you go it's all ready to go and I'm not gonna cook these for probably another I don't know 15 20 minutes so it's just in the pouch and ready to go the grill's preheated to about 400 to 500 degrees you're gonna take this and you're just literally gonna Set it on there. Yeah, on the top shelf. Actually, I'll put it and let it cook for about 20 minutes. And in 20 minutes, that thing will be done. So the next thing you see will be the finished product. Not close fit. Okay, it's been 15 minutes. Um, you want to cook them for 15 to 20 minutes, depending on how big they are and how many you have in there. So 15 minutes, they should be completely done. Yes, I'm cooking PW steak as well. But that's just, that's, the, that's a whole other video. So now that they're done. Just take them off, throw them on a plate, and the next thing you see will be um, the opening notes. The moment you've been waiting for, you literally just cut into the tin foil. Bear with me. Remember, there's two layers. They're probably gonna charred. So you cut into the tin foil, open them up, and there you go. You serve it straight from there, and that is how you make a healthy potato to replace fridge fries. And yeah, if you like the video, like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel, tell your friends, tell your family, tell your coworkers. Not CrossFit. You're welcome. Peace. Oh, you're welcome. You're welcome. Not CrossFit. You're welcome.